You might be surprised to see this review being posted today. Since yesterday, I finally uploaded my Ties Cars 4 movie, so you probably thought that I would take the day off, or I'd take a little break or something like that, and I planned on taking today off too. But then I remembered my birthday haul. These cars that I got for my birthday over a month ago, and I didn't get around to reviewing them until, like, last week. This review, for whatever reason, it really took a toll on me. I, I think I do need to take a break. But I don't want to just not upload. Maybe I should have someone else upload for me tomorrow. Back in 2012, after Cars 2 came out, there was this short video released in Eastern Europe, most likely in Russia. And the video was about Mater helping a pity getting across the road. It was most likely meant for children to learn how you cross the road. And although I can't be certain about that since it was in an Eastern Europe language. Yeah, in that short, Mater looks like a zebra. This, of course, referencing the uh, where you cross the road thing. I forgot the name. So anyway, welcome back to yet another video where today we're going to be taking a look at my custom zebra mater. And just so you know, uh, Ty is taking a break today, so I am doing a review of my custom zebra mater. And yeah, I'm Robin Tilsider, by the way. So yeah, let's get started. Zebra Mater appeared in the short short video, like I mentioned in the intro, and where he helped uh, Pity crossing the road, and then Lightning drove up beside him. And I had a spare Mater from when, and I had a spare Mater from the Samachani two pack, which I got back in two thousand eleven. So I've had this Mater for quite a long time and I finally decided to repaint it into something. So yeah, uh, starting up on the front I basically copied what I saw on the video. He has a white front, white teeth of course and I tried to paint around the headlight there and the black stripe which is supposed to go on the side. You only ever see him from this side so I just assumed the other side looked something similar. And uh, then the uh, engine block thing is black. In the short, actually, underneath it's white. It's only the top thing that is black. But I just painted the entire thing black to keep it easy, to make it easier on me. And as you can see, I actually kept the eyes of the original Mater, which is definitely an improvement over my usual customs, where I just have dots. And yeah, uh, moving on to the side, as you can see I didn't paint the rims on the tires, the wheels, which maybe I should do that at some point, although I'm not exactly sure how he, how those looked like in the short because I haven't seen it in a while, and when I was painting this car I didn't pay attention to that. Yeah, as you can see just uh, zebra stripes all over the car, like uh, here and I. I, I try to just do it as random as possible. And on top, also some stripes. Didn't paint the lights up top. I did avoid repainting the. I avoided repainting the uh, little orange light thing here. Moving on to the back, I just kept that white. I'm not sure if that there's supposed to be anything back there, but since we didn't see it in the short, I just kept it like this. The tow cable system is not completely black, but that's because it's just really hard to paint in here, even with a brush, which is what I use. And uh, yeah, this part, the back, is also not completely white, but it's good enough. You usually see it from this direction anyway, so you don't really see that. We've got to the other side, you got more patterns. Personally, I think this is a bit more col a bit more organized than the other side, that's because I first did this side, then this side. 
Once again, the rims are not repainted. And uh, yeah, this is the base, just the normal base since I didn't bother repainting it. So yeah, this custom is pretty good. I like it a lot. And at first I, I didn't really care much about it, but then it started growing on me. So yeah, uh, this will be the last video you'll be seeing with me today. But I might return to this channel in the future whenever Ty really makes another movie and needs to take a break for a day afterwards, probably. Whenever that's happening. Anyway, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys next time, whenever that is. Bye now.